Alright, I'm going to do a quick uh, part two on the automatic drinker system I built for the rabbits. There's the uh, five gallon bucket that holds the water. And uh, drilled a hole. Now I made a mistake on this. I drilled a little bit too close to the bottom, so it was kind of a pain to tighten this uh, bulkhead fitting up. And then I just uh, threaded this nipple in so that I can then start my PVC. And you can see um, it comes down and then goes into the cages. The top cage is up here. A branch off of this line. And then this one goes down to the bottom cages. There's six cages and they each are set up like this. The main line comes across the top and then a piece comes down to the drinker. I'll post a link on this video where you can order these uh, these PVC uh, tees and the, the drinkers. Try to get a better picture of the drinker here. There it is. It's all brass. And uh, just uh, they push down on the little barb in the middle, and the water comes out. So that's uh, how we did it. And uh, you can kind of see, I can't back up far enough to get all of it in view. But each uh, cage has a drinker. And then the one last thing I did was this is a clean out for any debris that might get down in here rather than it going into the into the nipple. It comes here and I can unscrew this and uh, I can bleed the system with that too. I can empty it and clean it out and I can also get it catches debris in here. So each cage has uh, a little clean out with scrap PVC that I had laying around after cutting cutting everything else. So um, now the next thing is getting these rabbits to drink out of uh, the drinkers rather than their water bottles. So we'll hopefully figure out how to teach them to do that. Alright, thanks for watching. Have a good